this is going to be your um, bronzer video bronzer one of my very favorite products and it's become more and more and more so there's so many different forms of bronzer there's gels there's creams there's powders you're gonna have to find uh, bronzer tones with universal appeal and um, you can choose ones that have shimmer and ones that do not so let's get started with bronzer I'm going to be putting a uh, video in here that shows me demoing how I get my glow up on using a variety of bronzer techniques and that should be fairly helpful for you guys but I'm going to talk you through the basics of bronzer just so that you have it um, basically finding the right color for you is going to be a little bit experimental uh, you know we're so personalized when it comes to makeup but I like to keep different tones of bronzer within my kit because even layering bronzers can be the best scenario for getting that right look because just using one bronzer everywhere can look awfully obvious as far as it not suiting your tone so building it up in layers or building it up um, with various products looks the most authentic to me and I do that using both um, using mattes and using shimmers so I will anchor everything with matte bronzers and then I build it into uh, shimmers later uh, because I really like that glowy look but that might not be the look that you're going for and you might not even like a glowy look. So uh, there are a full range of bronzers out there and I really like this video that I made on the glow up because I, I find that it shows how layering the bronzers really really work well. Now applying bronzers. Um, are going to be varied depending if it's a cream product or a powder product and whatnot um, but again using your brushes are great but then having your sponge nearby in order to do any uh, corrective work is really important okay so finding the right look is a little bit experimental you guys you will use bronzer as an enhancement to your overall look sometimes you can create a look that is bronzer forward so that you can focus on the sun-kissed skin and a little else Remember that each product or tool can become a focus, but in most cases it is used to warm the skin and to create a glow. I'm kind of reading here because there's a lot I want to tell you. You can apply the bronzer using fingers, liquid or cream, a sponge or a brush. Use a large fluffy brush, which will allow the bronzer to appear more diffused and dispersed. Notice when you put the bronzer on areas that the sun hits the face, how it can create dimension and warmth. So basically where you want to apply it is going to be wherever the sun hits the face. So just keep in mind that your sun is going to hit the face on all of the high points of the face, okay? So having it across the forehead, having it using the three here, that is usually your best bet for bronzer and, the, and touching the tip of your nose. Um, but you can disperse it everywhere so that you have a little bit of warmth everywhere. Just keep that in mind. Um, and now we're going to be thinking about bronzer to pull the colors of your skin and your neck and your face together and your chest. So use your bronzer as your blender. So blending your neck into your face color and blending your chest all, pulling it together. Bronzer is going to be your pull together product, whether that be using um, mattes first or shimmers on top or just a shimmery bronzer whatever it takes whatever you enjoy using is totally fine just make sure that you're using your bronzer to pull everything together your ears and even the back of your neck if your hair is up so just keep all those things in mind with bronzer and we're going to move on to our assignment so your assignment experiment with different bronzing mediums apply half the face with creams and half with liquid bronzers to see if you have a model to experiment on, experiment on them and try it on them. Try using a matte and try using a shimmer to see the different effects on each. And um, I want you to research some brands that are highly rated for bronzers uh, at stores like Sephora or any store that has bronzer. You can obviously use a drugstore, you can obviously use uh, Ulta or any of those stores. Make a list of the top five bronzers in powder, cream and liquid form and that will give you a gauge. My very favorite bronzer of all time um, happens to be the Kevin Aqua Neo Bronzer. It just seems to work always on everybody. 
it's really a beautiful interesting color it's unique I haven't seen anything quite like it so I'm just giving you that little tidbit of information and um, yes we are going on just going to be the contour and highlight um, face shapes and all that good stuff so make sure you hang in there and keep rolling through as we go into contour and highlight and face shapes